All right. I had to make this video because there's a bunch of retards. I'm sorry. You know, I'm sorry if you're offended by the word. I just don't care. I don't care. I speak my mind and that's how it is. You know, I go on Twitter today. There's a bunch of stupid idiots that say uh, Saquon Barkley wouldn't help the New York Giants out. So it doesn't even matter. They could pick them and it wouldn't even wouldn't even matter. We're going to win the division next year. Um, you guys are fucking stupid. You're idiots. You're dumb. You should get your fucking head checked. Twitter is for retards. Twitter is for antisocial people that go and fucking suck each other's dicks to get liked. That's it. That's all it is for. There's no intellectual people on Twitter. I'm on Twitter right now. I have over 1,200 followers. Actually, no. I have over 1,100 followers for doing absolutely nothing but shit giggling and fucking around. It's not hard to have a Twitter account and get followers. All you have to do is be funny. There's a bunch of fucking antisocial morons that think they can get a job by being a writer or whatever. It's not going to happen. Because guess what? You have to have actual skill to get somewhere in life to be a sports writer or be on camera or do whatever. You can be anybody and create a Twitter handle and create bullshit to be liked. It's not hard. Alright? These fucking morons... And let me tell you something, because I'm probably going to get mad right here. These fucking morons have the audacity to say that the New York Giants wouldn't get better with Saquon Barkley next year. These fucking morons, these retards, these idiots, are the same fucking people. Oh, I'm about to explode. I can't do this. These idiots are going off, based off, the last season that the New York Giants played. The one where they took the took a dump, 13-13, uh, their team was complete shit, and they're going based off their record. Do you know how many injuries the New York Giants as a team suffered? Defense and offense? Last year, I feel, I think their main wide receiver was Tavares King. He is horrible. Awful. And guess what? Eli Manning threw for 400 plus yards on our Super Bowl winning defense with that shitty ass wide receiver. Do you know what they would, he would do to us with wide receivers like Odell Beckham Jr., Sterling Shepard, Ingram, fucking Brandon Marshall, Saquon Barkley? Do you know what he would do to us? And not to forget that their defense was completely injured last year. Completely. Like, I'm talking no defense whatsoever. Their defense before last year's was ranked number two in the league in the regular season. Number two. I just looked it up. Go check it out. Number two. They're going to get everyone back next year besides DRC because they're walking away from DRC. But they're going to replace him. If they get Saquon Barkley, we are fucked. We're screwed. Because guess what? Our defense, believe it or not, really wasn't that good. It wasn't. I'm going to be honest. It was all pressure. Our secondary was below average. Our pressure helped our secondary. We'll see what Sidney Jones does, but in my opinion, it won't even matter. Everyone is going based off what we did this year. Everyone <laughs> ridiculed me for wanting Saquon Barkley on our team to make our team better. I'm sorry, you guys can go fuck yourselves. I, I don't care. I don't care who that hurts. I want my team to get better. And seeing the Giants team next year with Saquon, Saquon Barkley, they have to add what? One offensive lineman? Seeing that team with Saquon Barkley is horrible. It's awful. And we would absolutely, absolutely, absolutely not win the division with this Giants team and our Eagles team stacking up against each other. It's not happening. And people have the audacity to come on, can't, uh, come on my YouTube page and talk shit to me for wanting to make my team better by adding Saquon Barkley and trade up to get a future running back who could potentially be the the pound-for-pound pound best player to ever play in the game. People are criticizing me for wanting to get Lombardis and not never stop getting Lombardis. People don't care that this guy is going to go to the New York Giants and destroy us every single year. People don't care. 
our fan base is full of a bunch of idiots, morons, losers. These people that represent us on Twitter don't know a fucking thing about the sport of football. This is a year-to-year -year league. Them getting Saquon Barkley would make them the favorites to win the division. Just like that. Did anyone think we were going to win the Super, Super Bowl last year? Going into the season? No. I didn't. I had us at 11-5. It's a yearly year league. They could easily turn it around. I'm just... Uh, I pray to God that the Cleveland Browns either draft this guy or we trade up to get him. I pray. Because if the New York Giants get Saquon Barkley, we're in a shitload of trouble. For years. Not even this year. Years. And um, I don't just want one title. I'm sorry. The Giants have four. I want to catch up to those motherfuckers. I don't know. Maybe I'm just the only one. But it is what it is. That's all I got to say. Twitter's for a bunch of retards. That's all I got to say. Bye.